Hello, I'm Ansko Yamaguchi from Database Center for Life Science, and I would like to talk about the application of log sulfur to multiple protein sequence alignment. Um, the increase of data has made it difficult to analyze the alignment sequence, so we developed a prototype of new viewer for multiple protein sequence alignment for a large number of proteins named Ash Viewer. For Ash Viewer, um, various types of annotations are necessary to find new knowledge from an, from an alignment. And we considered um, various types of annotations for a large number of proteins as instance of various classes having some relation to the instances of protein class. So, for example, the um, um, for instances in the, that protein class, um, annotation which a uh, user would like to have is, for example, active site. So there should be some relationship from instances and instances. But um, we don't we don't know how the relationship relations expressed in LOD to support to find the relation in ROAD, we use ROAD SAFA API. ROAD SAFA, using ROAD SAFA API, for example, from pro first we enter some protein class as, for example, Uniprot protein. Then using the uh, URL, uh, we can find all reachable classes and we, for example, as a, a reach of, um, output class, we um, we used this class. Then input class and output class are in, uh, selected. So um, candidate pass uh, listed, and one pass is selected by user, so um, federated Spark query are generated, and we can get result. Uh, it's a whole image of root Safa. Using root Safa API, um, user can get um, result from root using federated search query. This time, uh, we used Ash Viewer as a um, client of Root Safa API. So, um, from Ash Viewer, um, input class and output class is sent to Root Safa API. So, Root Safa API you searched, you, uh, used filleted, uh, by filleted search, um, Root Safa API obtained data and returned to return the result to Ash Viewer. At this by Hakasson, I would like to update the pathfinding function of root sub API, and I would like to convert some protein-related data into RDF. Thank you. Okay.